Hey, what's going on guys? It's Zombie and welcome back into awesome Minecraft video and today guys we will be going over a very awesome Minecraft mod We'll be going over the Minecraft creepypasta mod guys before this video begins Make sure you slap that like button down below you guys got three seconds of like three two one and Leave a comment down in the comment section down below right now guys. What is your favorite creepypasta? of all time let me know down in the comment section down below so this mod actually adds in a lot of different creatures into your minecraft world and this isn't the usual creepy pasta mod that i use this is a different one because it adds in uh several different characters which you'll see in uh in just a second but yes as you guys can see there are actually new spawn eggs that we can actually spawn in so we're gonna spawn in some of these characters so we have james williams lost silver Slenderman, Eyeless Jack, Laughing Jack, Tiki to Toby, Smile Dog, The Bloody Painter, and Robert the Doll. So, as you guys can see right there, there are uh, some new creepypasta characters that we actually have not ever seen before that we're going to be going over for the first time in this video. So, starting out first, we have James William. Um, I have no idea who James William is, but yo, bro. James, I just want to say you are looking absolutely beautiful today. I, I just want to point that out there um, For you right now. You're looking beautiful. Okay, man. I just want you to know that uh, Up next is lost silver and this is a Pokemon Creepypasta as you guys can see right here. This is actually one of the characters from Pokemon and what happened to your hands, bro? Why are they missing? How do you eat if you have no hands? How do you see if you have no eyes? I don't I don't get it but yes, guys, as you can see, he has a lot of health. He's like a boss, I guess. I don't know why he's a boss. It's kind of weird. Up next is the Slenderman. So as you guys can see here, this is Slenderman, who's also a boss. And he has a lot more health, I think. And uh, you know what's so odd? He's not that big. Look at him. He's literally the size of me. Normally, Slenderman is supposed to be, like, really big. But no, he just... He's my size. I, I, I don't understand. That, that makes no sense. Uh, moving on, we have Eilish Jack. So, as you guys can see right here, this is Eilish Jack. Uh, he's pretty cool. And all of them seem like they're bosses, except for the first one that I spawned in. <laughs> uh, after Eilish Jack, we have Laughing Jack. Which, um, I mean, they're both called Jack, but I'm pretty sure they're different. Pretty sure they're different. And is this guy a boss? Um, he looks like he might be, but I don't see his, like, little... I don't see his health bar. Bro, where's your health bar? I don't get it. Alright, fine, whatever. I'll stop fighting you then. Up next is Tiki Toby. Uh, and Tiki Toby actually has a weapon. They have an axe. And bro, let me see your face. Oh, look at them, guys. They they are cool looking. Again, I'm really not sure who half of these characters are. If I'm being honest, I I really don't. The only one I really know so far is Slenderman and Lost Silver. So I I really don't get the other guys. If I'm being honest. So yeah, here we go. Let's knock this guy out. And then up next is Smile Dog. So if you guys like Smile Dog, look at this dog right here. Totally not an evil dog whatsoever. Uh, after Smile Dog, we have the Bloody Painter. And the Bloody Painter kind of looks like the purple guy from Five Nights at Freddy's. Except for he's not purple. He, he, he looks weird. I'm not going to lie, bro. Bro, you don't even have that much health. I can just swing my sword at you and just knock you out in like two seconds, bro. What is up with that? Why do not I have that much health, bro? You're a freaking boss. Oh, well, he, he, he's dead now. Um, okay, fine. Um, up next is Robert the Doll. So this is Robert the Doll, as you guys can see here. And Robert the Doll is actually a very, 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 very scary doll. Look at that. You're, you're like, you look like a person. Are you sure you're not like a person that became a doll? Because you look like a person, sir. I just want to point that out right now. Moving on from Robert the Doll... We actually have some more here. We have, um, we actually have a few more. We have the, the hoodie. So this is the hoodie. It's literally a guy wearing a hoodie that has, like, pitch black skin and, like, two red dots for eyes. So that's a little bit eerie. Not gonna lie. Up next is Dr. Eggman. What the flip? Dr. Eggman, you do not look like you have generated in the game correctly. Uh, and then we have, last but not least, Sonic.exe. Who, for some reason, also looks a little weird. I'm really not sure why they look like that, but they do. So, that's just how things are. They just, they, they look like the way they do. That, 
that's just how things work. I did see some other items. I want to take a look at some of these other items and see what they do, if they do anything at all, because I'm not, I'm not sure. What is this? Dr. Eggman spawn. Why does Dr. Eggman have two eggs? They don't even work. This one just spawns in two. I'm so confused. All right, the paint roller. What, oh, the, okay, so each of these spawns in the character. Oh, that makes sense. All right, what does the pedestal do then? Well, we're, we're about to find out right now. What does the pedestal do? The pedestal, maybe I got to put paper on it. Maybe I got to put books on it. I'm not sure what it does. I'm really honestly not sure what the pedestal does. Um, anyways, moving on from that, we have some armor and some weapons. Let's go over the some of this. So we have the gas mask. As you guys can see right here, you can actually wear uh, a gas mask, which is pretty cool. Uh, moving on from the gas mask, we have uh, the casual clothes. Why why casual clothes? I don't I don't get what that has to do with anything. But I mean, if you want to wear casual clothes, you can wear that. Again, not sure what that has to do with anything. Uh, then we have the Slenderman armor. So if you want to look like Slenderman, there you go. Look at me, guys. I'm officially Slenderman. Uh, and then after Slenderman, we got ourselves the Bloody Painter mask. So if you want to look like the Bloody Painter, there you go. Look how happy I am. I'm smiling. I'm happy. Uh, and then after him, we have the hoodie, which, as you guys can see right here, makes you look pretty cool. Doesn't change your face, though. Just makes you wear a hoodie. And it gives you speed, apparently, which is pretty cool. And then moving on from those, we actually have uh, a few weapons. We have the hatchet and the tricky axe, um, both of which uh, do... No, one does eight damage, and the other does nine damage. So they do more damage than, say, a diamond sword, but they don't really do that much difference. Like, I I'm going to hit this guy right here, and boom! Wait, let's find the bloody painter. Where's the bloody painter at? Aha! Are, are you the right one? Um... I, th I think my game is broken. Uh, why can't I hit like half the people? I don't. I don't get it. Um, okay. Well, I'll just use this instead then. Let me fight this guy. Oh my gosh, guys! Look how fast his health is going down. Now that we got this new weapon. Oh my goodness, guys! Look at that. We just kicked his butt. So that did nine damage. Nine damage. So like that's like two more than a diamond sword because a diamond sword does seven. This does nine, so it's like way better, which is pretty awesome, not gonna lie. Dude, I can see your face, Sonic. Like, I don't know if you guys could tell, but I you can see a little bit of Sonic's face on the top of his head. Bro, you need to fix yourself. You look weird. I'm not even gonna lie. All right, guys. Well, this was the Creepypasta mod. Hopefully, you guys did enjoy this video. Uh, hopefully, you guys did. If you did, leave a like on today's video. And if you guys are new to the channel, make sure you do hit that subscribe button and enable notifications so that you never miss a video from me ever again. Follow me on Twitter, Instagram, at RealZombieSMT. And make sure you guys add my Facebook page, ZombieSMT. I'll see you next time. Have a great day. And as always, peace out. Bye, everyone. Bye-bye.